Financial planning. How to conduct a financial checkup. Most experts suggest to conduct a regular personal financial checkup on an annual basis or after a major life event such as marriage or divorce. It's important to follow a system when reviewing your finances to make sure you don't leave anything out or miss something critical to your financial well-being. Here are the main topics you should cover when conducting a financial checkup. Life changes. Review any major changes in your life have taken place since your last financial checkup. Have you changed jobs, gotten married, divorced, welcomed a new family member, bought a house, moved or retired? Each of these life events can trigger changes to your overall financial picture. As you go through the section below, consider how these life changes may alter your plans moving forward. Financial goals. Financial goals are simply financial targets with a plan in a place to read them. Building a retirement fund is one example of a financial goal. Others include creating an emergency fund, saving up for a down payment on a car or house, or anything else that requires money you don't already have. Evaluate your progress toward financial goals and adjust as needed. Once you achieve a goal, cross it off the list and replace it with another. Budget. Your budget is a blueprint for how you handle income and expenses on a recurring basis. A budget should be monitored and adjusted monthly. The idea is to make sure you have enough income to cover all expenses and still have funds to meet uh, your financial goals. You can maintain your budget with pencil and paper using a computer spreadsheet or with one of many available free or inexpensive budget software programs. Debt. Review your progress in paying down all debt, including loans and credit cards. If your debt is Debt is rising, especially credit card debt. It might be time to adjust spending so that those balances start to decline again. Two popular ways to reduce debt are the snowball method and the avalanche method. Evolute interest rates on everything from your mortgage to your car loan to credit cards. Consider refinancing or switching to another credit card with a lower rate. Credit Report and Score The three main credit reporting companies, Equifax, Experian and TransUnion, are required by federal law to provide you with a free copy of your credit report each year. Obtain your reports at annualcreditreport.com. Check for errors and report any you find immediately. Credit reporting agencies are not required to provide you with a free Phi saw credit score, but you can obtain yours for a reasonable fee. Some banks and other websites provide the free credit scores, but not all are official FISA scores. Use the suggestions that come with your reports to help to help raise your credit score. Retirement savings. As part of your financial checkup, evaluate your contributions to your company. Make sure you are maxing out any employee much. Consider taking out the traditional or Ross era. The advantage of Ross era is the tax diversification that comes with the tax free withdrawals upon retirement. Evaluate returns on your investments and rebalance your portfolio as needed. Consider your change in risk tolerance both as you age and as the market becomes more or less volatile. Experts generally agree that your goal should be to put at least 15% of your pre-tax income into retirement savings. Other savings. Review your progress towards other savings goals such as an emergency fund that cover between 30 and 90 days of living expenses, college savings funds uh, 529 or Coverdell SS or vacation fund if you hand to dip into your emergency fund for house or car repair. Plan to replace those funds as quickly as possible. In addition, check available interest rates to make sure your savings are going into the 
uh, highest yielding accounts possible. Taxes. The tax cuts and job act passed at the end of uh, 2017 had a big impact on financial finances, uh, personal finances. The Internal Revenue Services suggest that taxpayers conduct a paycheck checkup using its World Withholding Calculator and make changes to withholding, if called for. If you are self-employed, even part-time, don't forget to revelate, revaluate quarterly estimated payments as part of your financial checkup. Make sure you have records for all tax dedications. Um, uh, dedications or credits for retirement or education savings, dependent care, medical expenses and donations. Pay attention to deadlines for dedications and retirement contributions and in general keep all tax documents in one place. You may want uh, to settle a meeting with your tax and financial advisor as part of your finance, financial checkup to plan tax strategy. Insurance. Insurance needs change over time. Make sure you have an appropriate amount of life insurance, disability insurance for income protection and homeowners or renters insurance, including flutes insurance if appropriate for your location. Revaluate health insurance needs to including taking out a long term care insurance policy if you feel you need it. Consider switching insurance companies or raising dedicatables on home and auto policies to lower premiums. You can also save money by bundling policies under any one company. Estate plan. Evaluate or create your estate plan. Review you will or trust to make sure you are happy with your choice of executor or trustee and anyone to whom you grant power of attorney. Review beneficiaries and allocations to make sure they match you can't wishes access your living will or other advanced directives. If necessary, engage on an estate planning al al attorney to make sure you follow all uh, all applicable state and federal laws with any changes you make. Uh, the bottom line: when you are finished with your financial checkup, you may want to consult one of or more experts including a trusted financial advisor uh, or other specialist estate planning lawyer, uh, insurance agent, tax advisor to make sure you have not left out anything important. Make a written note of all changes you have decided to make as a result of your checkup and put in place a plan to make those changes as soon as possible. Then relax until it's time to do it all again next year. Participate in a 1 million crypto giveaway. Interested in trading cryptos? Tastyworks is giving away for up to 1 million dollar to quality. You just need to open and find a brocade account. You can get 50 dollars worth of crypto when you found with 2000. Uh, or get uh, 200 worth of crypto when you find with $2,000. Learn more about training with Testworks in link below. Uh, it's all for now, guys. Today we, uh, it's uh, today we uh, talked about uh, financial uh, checkup, how to conduct it, and it's uh, in the series of our videos of financial planning. Goodbye.